Hi, this is Todd Monning with FMCA.com, and I'm here today. Uh, Paul Tinkles from Fortrev Wink is going to talk about a very impressive coach. It's the 2009 Nimbus CE. Hi, Paul. How you doing? I'm doing fine, Todd. Thank you for uh, coming and looking at a Fort Travel. Uh, my pleasure. Okay, I'll tell you a little bit about this coach. It is a 2009 uh, CE Nimbus. It's a 45-foot coach powered with a 500 horse Cummings with an Allison transmission. Mm -hmm. uh, it has three slides on it, and on our slide rooms, we put a pneumatic air seal all the way around these slide rooms. Pneumatic air seal. Which is an air bladder, mm -hmm. and uh, you deflate the, the seal when you move the room, mm -hmm. and when you get the room either in and out, you inflate it again just by turning a key. Keeps all the wind, the water, the dust out of it, and also when the room comes in, you have a nice smooth finish on the oh, on yeah. the outside. So it's like easy, easy to maintain. Very easy to maintain. That is correct. Okay. Uh, on our on our uh, bay doors, mm -hmm. everything that's underneath the slide room, I'll show you how that works. Okay. Everything underneath a slide room is going to have a side hinge door, which opens to the side. That makes it a lot easier to get into the coach. As you'll notice, there's a, a tray in here. Mm -hmm. It slides out. Uh, this particular one is manual. We can do them electric oh, also. That's a lot of storage. That's a lot of there. storage. goes all the way through. Todd, I want to show you how we do our, uh, our engine compartment back here. One of the things we do, uh, we have the doors that open up like this. Makes it very easy to get into the back of the uh, coach to the engine. If uh, techs love to work on our coaches because we have side mounted radiators on our. Oh, on you our, do? That's, yeah, yeah, so I it's easy to get back in here. If a tech needed to get down here, there's a couple of wing nuts over here you can take loose. This whole thing, this whole thing okay. comes, comes Every, off. Everything's accessible. Isn't everything's it? accessible right on there. there. And this is, the, this is the ISM Cummins engine 500 horse right mm -hmm. here. Okay, Paul, you want to show me the I front? I want to show front? you the front of the coach. What do we have here, Paul? Todd, this is the generator. Uh, this is the generator compartment, and I'm going to okay. slide that out. It's an, on an electric motor. Is that a 12? This is a 12K, 12 and a half K. You can run everything on the coach with this with this generator. One other feature, you see these retrievals right here? This, yes. Uh, mm -hmm. what, what you can do, let's say you're at Perry, Georgia, and you get stuck and it rains. Oh, no. Oh, it does sometimes, okay? I know. Uh, you don't have to worry about a, a guy in a tow truck not knowing what he's doing, tearing up your motorhome. This you pop off with these, uh, the front of it pops off here with these bolts, and then he can slide his sleeve in here, hook it up, and pull you out forward, and he doesn't tear up your motorhome. Oh, wow. Because of Perry, Georgia, we started putting on these on our coaches about five years ago. Really? That's, that's a right. Great, it's a really great, nice feature. That's a great yeah. feature. It saves you a lot of That's money right. Extra. And we'll move that back in. That's a 12.5 12, 12 kW Onan generator. That's, that's real slick the way that comes in and out. Yep. And those hooks are something you hope you don't want to have to use. I'd love to see the inside. Let's I'm go sure inside you. and take a look. Thanks. Go ahead. Wow. Look at the cabinets, cabinetry. Right. Todd, one of the things we have always been known for at Fort Travel are, is our cabinetry. We do all of this in-house. This particular coach has uh, African mahogany. This mm. is Af African mahogany. And uh, you can look at a um, Ford Travel that's 10, 12 years old, and the um, coach has been taken care of. It'll, the cabinetry still look just like this when you walk into it. Really? And the reason for that is is the way we build our chassis. Uh, that you know, you, you, all your corners will still fit. Mm -hmm. They all look they all look good. If you'll notice, there's ceramic tile. This is just like what you'd put in your home, and um, we don't have any problem with cracking because our chassis does not flex. It does not flex. Right. Uh, if you'll notice, this particular coach <clears throat> is the Texas edition. It has the Texas interior on it. You notice the cowhide. Uh, it really gives it a nice, a nice look for the, uh, for the Texas flavor. Uh, this is just one of the floor plans that we would make. It ha this one has the the uh, TV in the back of it. Todd, there's one thing that I want to mention to you is the way what, this is in Teletech lighting. Mm -hmm. If you'll notice that uh, all of the, uh, everything is labeled on there. So if you want to turn a particular light on, let's say you want to turn the hall light on, 
uh, you have that labeled and oh, you don't yes. have to, a lot of times the coaches will have uh, toggle switches which you don't have a clue where they go, you have to learn where they go. Right. This is a very, very, very nice so you, uh, feature on the coaches. You always know exactly you which always, light is on and right. groping around for that's the right, right switch. That's right, and we have several panels in the coach. There's this panel, there's a couple of panels up front, mm -hmm. and then in the back there's there's panels. And also I'd, uh, I didn't mention to you that uh, this coach has uh, tile heat. Uh, underneath it. Oh, really? So you can actually you can turn that um, uh, thermostat on at four o'clock in the morning, and you get oh. up and you know the the floor is nice and warm. Oh, and yeah. if you know you set it to come on at four and go off at ten or whatever, and so it's really really nice feature. Because so more more and more coaches we're building have have tile mm -hmm. in them rather than carpet. Right. They're much easier to keep. That's a nice cozy feel. That's right. That's right. I, I noticed you also have a large uh, stainless steel refrigerator over here. And that uh, that's because that's a residential refrigerator which comes with a all electric coach. Mm -hmm. uh, we uh, we build all electric coaches and we also build the um, LP and and electric. So. It depends on how the customer wants it, uh, mm -hmm. we will build it. About half of the coaches we build today are custom coaches. You, you, you and your wife can come in with a generic floor plan of what you want in a coach and we'll build it just like you build your house. Mm -hmm. uh, you can pick out your the wood, you can pick out your mm -hmm. furniture you want in it, uh, however you want it. If you want an all electric coach or if you want an LP electric coach, mm -hmm. we can do that. So, so it's like picking out their dream home. Just picking out your dream home, that's right. that's right. <laughs> Live in luxury. Live in luxury, that's right. <laughs> And once again, this is a 45 foot. This is a 45 foot. Okay. This is the half bath, and I want you to look at the size okay. of this. This is the half bath in the coach, and um, it's going to give you another lavatory. Uh, if you have uh, another couple traveling with you in a coach, uh, you, you have a, a bath for both parties, which makes it real convenient. Todd, as we go into the uh, bedroom, you'll see we have uh, what we call a east-west bed. Where you have an east-west bed, and this is a California queen bed, and where you have an east-west bed, you can, which goes uh, uh, horizontal with the coach, uh, you can put a dresser back here if you'll notice all the storage that we have. Our coaches are more residential. We, we make our coaches to look like your home. Yeah, I get uh, that feel. Yeah, a lot, of your, a lot of our customers live in their coaches. They live in them full time. So you, you have the rear bath back here, you have a stacked washer and dryer, which is more like a residential. It's, uh, you can get a, a larger load in the, than you can if you have just the combination. Mm -hmm. So with a 45 foot, you can do a lot of things that, uh, that you're not able to do in a shorter coach. Right. But we do make coaches in 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, and 45. Wow. We, we do not cookie cut our coaches, we hand build them. And that's the reason that we, can, uh, we don't back up from anyone when it comes to quality on our, on our coaches. Uh, anyone interested in uh, looking at our product, you can get online, fortravel.com. All of our inventory is on there. You uh, can go to sales. We also have a website for our sales uh, area, which is fortraveloftexas. Dot com, and you can look at uh, all of our inventory as it flows in and out uh, of our inventory there at the factory. This is Todd Monning from FMCA.com at FMCA's 81st International Convention in Perry, Georgia.